It was already a blow up, it's a screen blow up. Damn. I couldn't see it, I promise. That dropped. Well, there's no backlog for Necro, is there? You just double jump. Or you just super jump. I did the wrong thing. Hmm. Whoa. <laughs> Where'd my combos? Why is that name trade? Oh my god, those don't combo. But I can't seem to get the parries. Why is he backing off? Did you just try to parry it? That's death. Nice clean screen. Now I can see what I'm doing. I parried that so high that... What the hell, I never see that normal. Should have shook out. That wasn't guaranteed stun at all. What did he say? And what did he say afterwards? I need him to know I didn't mean it. Oh, that's unfortunate. That comboed. Uh, I jumped really late because one of my crutch fierces was late. Tried to red parry, missed it. At least I missed it the good direction. Hmm. <laughs> he knew who I was. Now I feel extra bad. I picked on a very nice and very, very innocent man. That parry. Oh my god, the god hitbox. That was too slow. I wonder if it's been a real year since I fought a Necro. Why do I keep on missing supers? This is a thing that never happens. Didn't reaction parry that. Oh shit. Oh shit. Make it stop. Why am I missing supers? Oh my god, everything's going wrong. Ugh. I would have like won like four times if I didn't drop a super. I dropped it there too. Oh shit. Couple ideas got 
wires got crossed in my head. Damn, he's being chill about it too, that's the worst. Because I'm dropping everything. Jump fierce, I think. This is a non setup. It's just for an overhead low mix up. God, I keep speeding everything. I forgot how Necro reco recoiled to that. The stomp hits on most characters, but it might have been because I was cornered. Hmm. I'd already parried and hit strong. Ooh. I misspaced that. Oh my god. Everything's going wrong. I'm still in this very much. Oh shit! How'd I get that charge? I threw a fireball. I didn't back up enough for my EX fireball anyway. There was no way to complete that combo. That combo, I think. I did. God, that's like beating everything. Or not that, but like, I'm... Why am I normal so sucking? Necro has some all her boxes for a lot of his stuff. And it's quick too. I have to respect normals more. Magnus Storm is probably Magnetic Tempest, whatever it is. Um, probably his best super in this matchup, actually. jail all of a sudden. Got to do Corotta setup. Should be alright. Damn, look at that. Projectile mean the whole time. Why'd I do that? Fireball, what did that do? What did it do? Ah oh, shit, dropped it. I had an unblockable there. Why'd I do the crutch medium light kick when the crutch medium kick was gonna kill? And they both had no ender. What? Slime dance? What? He picked the two frame throw. That button's good. I'm trying to play more respectful towards normals. Sick. 
Like, I didn't need to, like, be good in the matchup if I can land that. I still like Super 2 versus 12, but I'm going to pick Super 3 anyway. That's what I'm talking about. Being able to complete combos means you don't have to be better at other things in this game. I don't know why I thought that would be good. I don't know the frame data on all these buttons. Make it stop. I tried to stand strong in the last one. Oh my god. Nice. I was just trying to poke. But I got close strong. Twelve legitimately has pretty good normals. Ah. It's very hard to actually get that off guaranteed. I could have punished the first taunt with the uh, hard kick. Or was it medium kick? I could have done something that wasn't what I did. That would be an anti air hit. Wah. Where's the air dashes? This game has a really high skill setting, honestly. Like, really high. Like, way higher than Street Fighter 4 or 5 or fucking anything else you've probably played. Except maybe Marvel. Someone can be better than you. Like, way better than you. And still not even be good. It's the truth. I know, I felt that. Far strong. <laughs> Damn, Cookie just called me not good. That's a good burn, actually. Visually, it doesn't feel laggy or look laggy at all. But I feel like I feel a little lag. Not a whole lot. It's very playable. This is still like better player wins tier. Things can get real ugly if there's a lot of lag. That is dedication. Damn, I was trying to bait that. There we go. Ah! I tried to parry into punish. I hate this. Alright, cool. Huh.
Twice Strong is a little unsafe on Necro, because he can duck it. That one too. It all depends on the spacing. Necros are kind of low duck, but not too low. Oh my god. How do you block wrong on Necro? He only has lows. Most reactable overheads in the universe. That hit. That's a combo. I bit the bullet and made a read. Oh shit. I've been making absolutely no reads. I hate that because the two hits can be at really different times. I win this game without a training mode for what it's worth. This is a bad matchup for Aura, but not too bad. I tried to parry. Ah. Wow, that charge. Almost got it. It's a little sloppy, I haven't done it in a long time. That was the touch of Dizzy. Tara. Oh shit, you have to let him fall for that one. I forgot. Okay, that was scary. Oh shit, it's gonna hit me. Never mind. Huh? I just realized that. I didn't even know what to do. I haven't punished that in forever. Oh shit. <laughs> I went for swag. Nice. Just with the fireball line hit.
Non. Ah Oh shit, I forgot, destroyed two hits. Oh shit. Star tackle is not actually good urine. There are no girls on the internet, especially not a fighting game stream. This is like the place where girls would least likely be. Oh shit. Ah, to the parry, but too early. I didn't hit. Mistimed. Whoa! That was actual lag. It's still actual lag. Why did it suddenly get so bit bad? Bad trade. That's a combo I should have done in the TC. Ah! Ah! Oh my god. I'd already hit a button. Oh my god. Ah. I hit the wrong I hit I hit Roundhouse on accident. Not even joking. I I fucking winced when I when he when he did that. And I like pulled my controller to the side and Roundhouse is one of my nice. That's a really weird juggle. It's impressive they knew how to do it. Um, that's bad. Alright, no, it's not bad anymore. Uh, I miss timing that a lot. That even combo. Ah, oh, there it goes. I had a bunch of missed parries at the end. I didn't miss the parry on the overhead, and if I'd known that he was gonna, if I'd like been waiting and watching, I would have been able to parry the overhead. But what I did instead was I tried to do a reversal stomp, which is why I got slammed to the ground. Actually, that might always slam. And then I missed all my. Damn. Ah, oh, shit. Thought that'd be a good response. Alright, by me getting hit, I actually, like, put him into that.
If this guy can win one match, he can win, or rather, if he can win one round, he can win two rounds. Flat out. I also dropped a Crouch Fierce into Super that would have... Wow, well, I dropped it again! Killed him. And uh, I did a Stammer House when I should have done a Stand Strong that would have killed him. So I had some really critical drops. Ah, that's the second time that's happened. Nice. Long time whiner, first time watcher, what does that mean? I've heard long time reader, first time writer, and variations therein. But what the hell is a whiner? Nah, you can react to the difference between the two, I just messed up. The timing of those two parries is extremely strange, because it's nothing like the way they hit. I had a cross-up unblockable there that I should have gone for. Combos are hard on pad. Any Korean player who said that would be right. Korean combos are hard in general. And therefore are hard on pad. Uh. Damn it. That's bad. I stand strong, I hit while I was still midair. I've always been shit at that timing. Jump in, parry into stand, run house into stand strong. You think it would be really easy. The stand strong never came out. And I was still reacting to the fact that I successfully got the parry at the right height and got the run house at the right height. So I didn't, I missed. Is that backdash? What's that about? That's punishable. That was the hard spin knuckle. Which leads to full combos, but to compensate is very unsafe. Honestly, it should be safe. I've been there. You play a matchup a lot, the anti airs start getting really weird. Everything starts getting really weird. This guy's hella smack talking himself and he's playing okay. I don't like that. Um, yeah, this guy's playing alright. Ah, oh, shit. I missed both of those. I went for anti-air parries, but it's really greedy to go for anti-air parries on cross-ups, because the timing is extra small, because you can't buffer them.
you know you're hungry when you read copy pasta and you get hungry. You want pasta, rather. You know you're hungry when you get hungry. And other dank tautologies with Beth. That was a cool cross through. I did it. I did it again. Sloppy, sloppy. I did it too early. Next should jump in response to the oh, crouch hard kick, huh? I wonder if that's good. Whoa! I took a logic class in college, and one thing the professor, um, one thing you could do in the logic class was any time that there was, during your proofs you could use tautologies at any time and you wouldn't get marked down for it. So you could have like thousand step proofs, well you wouldn't, but you know, that's going to hit me midair so it's not so bad, but that's also, that still sucks. Lena's got a strong tendency to fall out of those. So you would have like extra steps in your proof that would be like A equals A if you wanted to. Oh shit, that was it. That was the kill. That was also the kill. That was also the kill. I could have just ended with an uppercut. But I am with hard cake. Okay, I know why I ended with hard kick. It's because hard kick leads to a lot more damage. I took a whole bunch of philosophy classes in college. Logic classes were pretty neat. Nice empty jump throw. I was going for anti-air parry, so... <laughs> Fuck! Is that a walk-in DP? What are you doing? I'm about to let it work. That grabbed me from so far away. Oh shit. Elena's special. She's one of three characters where you can't do um, overhead into stand strong as a combo in stones. jump through again. Whew. I can trade down. Pairing didn't exist, um, Makoto wouldn't change that much, and Yang would shoot up a lot. Wait, did anyone even mention Makoto? Hmm. I was up there for a long time, if I got all those parries. That was max damage with what I got.
Bit sloppy. Remy would be better. Remy would like shoot up quite a lot, actually. Maybe not the high, but definitely the high mid. Um, Hugo and Q would actually go down amusingly. Uh. This guy doesn't block low that often. Or actually, there's no combos from those. That's like one of the little weaknesses of his character. Whoa, that cancel. That was pretty cool. Higher damage combos than that. I just really like that combo. S. The highest score I've ever gotten in an actual match was SS plus plus. Wow, I tried to parry, but my double jump. Um, Made it hard, maybe? Oh my god. Those kinds of jumps are not good against Toro. I should have punished the first one. I heard an EX move. Those kinds of jumps are not good against Toro. Why isn't there a green Urian? That was a really awkward jump, so I didn't really have any good thing to do there. The universe overhead. <laughs> that dropped. I got a crutch medium kick instead of stay medium kick. Crutch medium kick is generously, well not generously, but it's slower. Uh, I parried, but really early. Those kinds of jumps are still not good. That was an accidental reset. Visible stun makes this game so fun. I guess it makes Street Fighter V fun as well. In a way. Oh, I did it again.
Jab doesn't inflict reset unless the stones run out. The stones ran out right as I hit jab. Oracle's medium punch is one of the best buttons in the whole game. It's safe, it's two parries. It leads to really big combos on re on it leads to okay combos as a raw confirm. And if you confirm it, it leads to huge combos. I'm in jail. Hmm. Didn't know what to do. That was a double P. Checking your swing in that kind of scenario is not bad. I can't think of anything I could have done there and I'm glad I didn't try to do anything. Chicken combo as possible onto twins in the corner. Um, I'm down for videos, but I can't promise ST. Check this out. Damn, never mind. I was relying on him to quick stand. Let's try again. Maybe I'll quick stand this time. Yeah. That's safe in a hit confirms too. I'm doing better than when we started. I think I just needed to um, figure out what was going on. Damn. I didn't have sufficient charging. That's not the ender there. Elena fell out twice! She fell out twice! Elena's so stupid. Oh my god, I hate this character. Ugh, that wasn't me, I promise. I swear I hit that combo. It's the lag. I did not jump there. Well, I did jump, but I hit punch as well. That was a kill combo. So is this one. Cool. I got it. Touch of Dizzy. And then I dropped the follow-up. It's alright. Yeah. So we your favorite fighting game. Yes. Congratulations, you figured it out. You can do the touch of Dizzy on Elena, um, Q and Chun-Li with hard kick, and then you can do a medium kick version on Necro, 
Shadows, 12. I won't give in. I'm the one who blew it. When I ate that many core circle forward light kicks in a row. Damn. Why does it get that one sometimes? Damn. Double damn. Hop. By dashing, I moved him into the path of the fireball, so that was cool. Looks like he tried to parry it. Mm. I've done nothing but miss my parries there. That scenario is actually really shit if you don't parry. Oh my god. It's really shit even still. Whew! I uh, could have easily EX uppercutted the overhead, but I wasn't thinking about EX uppercutting an overhead. I was thinking about EX uppercutting whether he'd be in range or not. And then he moved really far away. And then I wasn't very confident anymore. And then he did the overhead, and I was like, huh, and I blocked it. But I could have uppercutted. Random machine gun blow? That's not good. What the fuck? There's no super conversion there. I didn't get the meter until too late. Never blocks the toes. Oh. Oh shit. <laughs> I tried to style. Uh. People emulate Marvel 2, don't they? I thought that was a game you could emulate. <sighs> I tried to parry it. Parried it with my face. Dash under was too low. I had no pickup there. I got a fireball. That wouldn't have happened if I parried twice, which is what I should have done, by the way. Mm. Try to parry. Ow. Block that like on the last frame. Didn't block that at all. Oh my god, I mistimed that. Help. 
I just ate so much shit. Oh my god, where's my supers? I might die. Ah. Ah. I should have parried twice. I miss supers. That was actually safe. He hit me nice and deep. I dropped it again. Surprised that hit. I think he was surprised it hit too because he didn't mash it. Try to red parry. Ah. This is such a simple strategy and it's blowing me up. I feel like a fool whenever I lose to something really obvious. I kept on missing parry after parry after parry. I didn't want to go for the double parry, because there was always a possibility he could just hit a button instead of not doing that hammer hook. I need to bite the bullet and actually learn to red parry that. Because I miss it a lot. More often than I get it way more. Oh my god. That was safe. Damn it. That's a counter to that. I did it because I was desperate. I didn't have any other way to win. Uh, that beats anything I can do there. Except parry. The MVC2 has been ported before. It's not to Steam. But they could just literally just take the port they already made and put it on Steam. I don't actually know what to do there. I think it's medium kick. I thought they took it off and put it back on. Is it still off? Oh my god. I don't know what to do to literally stop him from just mashing like... Core circle forward, or half circle forward light punch. It sounds so stupid. But I actually don't know what to do to stop that. I actually have the Marvel 2 on my PS3. I build so much meter too. It legitimately is all because of the X-Men. That was a cool punish, right? Ah. 
I had no super there. I had a full juggle there. Keeps on parrying, but he's not getting the right parry. I could have killed there with the right combo. I thought Marvel could use it in literally everything except movies. I know it's just um, Marvel being weenies. In fact, I'm pretty sure that's it. Seeing as they just made a video game pretty recently with X-Men in it, didn't they? I paired really early. Me stand strong or back fierce. Ah, got my farf strong. That's so stupid. Hmm. There it was. It's weird to say, but that's the first time I've ever done that combo. There's a a spot where he can like win with like his pressure and win with his anti airs. So my main objectives are not to get to those spots. The angle of you parry one of them is so stupid. God damn it. I don't think that was a recent X-Men game per se, but I think that was a recent X-Men thing in a game. I did dash and parry and he didn't attack only after I'd already... Wah! Surprised he did anti-air parry there. I hate this scenario so much. It's so stupid. Uh, I tried to parry, but I was really early. Only one hit. No hits at all. I can't see a good way out of it. Block and then red parry the second hits of the core circle forward, hard punch, half circle forward, hard punch.
I feel dumb. I'm losing to something that literally anyone can do. Oh my god, this lag. Yeah, Street Fighter Five is made that way. That's not very. That did a lot of damage. I'm not sure I've ever seen the damage of um, that raw. Oof, that's a good anti-air for that range. It does so much damage, and it sets me back so far. Oh my god, random supers that keep working. Oh my god. Okay. Thank god. His setup was pretend. Damn, he said last few, like 10 games ago. Necro in general has, yeah, good anti -airs. I wish I hadn't interrupted that. It was better. I was better off not. I was better off letting him do it. Got the pickup. tried. That red parry is so hard. I hate characters where you need a red parry to shut them down. I'm going to eat a fucking random super any second now. Every round I lose bites me so hard. These wall plates are bouncing off me. This is how I always play. But the hammer hooks. Those are nailing me. I normally wouldn't have to play so much around it. Ooh, that was nice. Because normally I'd be picking Super 2. But in the interest of a fair fight... I'd already double jumped. I might have been able to parry, but I didn't try because I thought I would have to. I thought I'd fall into it, but I never fell. Or Necro Super 3 is probably 6 4 in Aura's favor. Or Necro Super 2 is probably. 7-3 in Aura's favor. If you want the numbers. Ah, that's so stupid. That's stupid. The hits were so far apart. Necro has the same HP as Aura. Eleven twenty. Every character, for the most part, is either eleven twenty or twelve hundred. That like beats everything I can do there. Except parry it. 
but even if I parry it, I'm not at a range where I can punish it with anything meaningful. So I should like parry it and punish it with a command grab. Uh, I'd already parried before the freeze, but uh, I didn't see that at all. It was invisible. Oh, Necro reacted to that in a very strange way. For some reason, I really like the combo neutral jump, hard kick, neutral jump, hard kick. I have to EX to Dizzy here. I don't know if I actually had to. But it's okay because I get the meter back. I should have been doing that a lot. I don't know why I only thought to do that right now. I've been trying to beat that with Stand Strong, but Light Uppercut's going to be a lot better at beating it. I tried and failed. Come here, grab F. Fuck, he tried to parry me, I tried to parry him, but his attack ended up being better at the end. Um, there's a line, but I can jump you to the front of it because no one's been asking for a while. I should switch back to Super 2. Look at the angle he flew at there. I gotta burn the super to kill him. I think I'm not gonna burn it. Alright. That went pretty well. I hop on fight kid now, because I'm literally right about to be done with this guy. Ah, I dashed in and parried, like, just hit a button. Oh, he could have hit me with a super. He mashed it all the way, and I didn't react. Ugh. Mashing parry like a fiend. I did my best to eat every attack that round. Not really, though. Uh, he got hit by a stupid reset. GG's.